Okay, so this is a lantern and I have installed that LED. There's a green LED and over here uh, it's the refiller where uh, we use to put kerosene. So I removed the base and this these are the wires. So I have got this push switch. So and with the help of this chisel like thingy I have uh, uh, made a hole over here and it goes over here so the thing is uh, if you can see from here this doesn't like move down so I believe I have to cut this uh, shell like thingy and see if I can fix this with that and made it make it push so let's see what happens okay guys so what I have done over here is made a hole amazingly that whole piece came out so it was pretty easy I used the electrical wire cutter and made the hole according to it this so as you can see this pops out a little bit and i'm gonna use this original so if you don't have this you can use a cold ring pad bottle cap that's made of this tin or steel or iron whatever you call it and this goes stealth mode so I can like just push it and it will work so it's working that's good so it's working it's working and if you don't know how to how to do the connections it's pretty easy uh, one wire goes to this like this wire and the supply comes over here and the other one directly goes to the ground wire so let's do the connections and check if this works or not okay so I have this uh, connector and I'm gonna use this for connecting the wires and I'm gonna solder one wire to this switch so let's solve it okay so I'm gonna switch it in and test if this works okay. the moment of truth so it's working and now I'm gonna insulate it all these and put a put acrylic sheet or cardboard here I think for now I'm gonna put cardboard here so I can change it let's see so I was uh, like trying to fix an acrylic sheet or and looking for cardboard but couldn't find any and I was drinking tea so this tea coaster fits exactly the same I'm pretty lucky today so I'm gonna just fix it and Let's check. So here's the lantern and here's the button. So pretty stealthy look. Looks good. So here's the final outcome. So I have cut this bottle and put it here as the glass, as a protector and this is the button I think the light is too bright it's 12 watt LED 220 volts and I'm gonna use like 3 watts so that's the project